The 34-year-old man returned home to Waller Avenue after spending the night in custody following a domestic altercation. Police were called to the home at around 1.30pm yesterday where it's alleged they found the man in his garage throwing beer bottles directly at them before arming himself with a plank of wood. Police were forced into a situation of um, dealing with this violent male. Subsequently, they've chosen to use the taser. The situation intensified after the man was tasered outside this house. It's alleged the 34-year-old male began to struggle violently, kicking a female sergeant to the head and a male constable to the face. But the violent display wasn't over, and once the man was finally arrested and placed in the holding cell back at Griffith Police Station, matters deteriorated even further. Upon opening up the dock, he's become violent again, very aggressive with police. Uh, police were again injured, with probably about five police in total receiving some form of injury. It's alleged the same female sergeant was kicked again, while the second female constable was kicked in the stomach. The female sergeant suffered bruising to her cheek and a possible fracture to her elbow, while the female constable is undergoing treatment for a hip injury. It's one of the most serious things because they're not disrespecting the individual, they're disrespecting the New South Wales Police and the New South Wales Police are representing the New South Wales communities. The man has been charged with two counts of assaulting police. He appeared in Wagga local court today and has been refused bail. Dean Foscarini, Win News.